Okay, so we're gonna have a look at isometric shoulder extension. So extension of the arm is this movement where we're taking the arm bone directly back in the shoulder joint. And um, to be able to strengthen that initially, what we wanna do is uh, move into a position that looks kind of like a hug and then just take the back side of your arm or the lower area of your tricep onto a wall or onto a corner or a post. Um, so maintaining that position that looks kind of like a hug we're going to just then drive that arm straight back as if we're trying to push that wall or post away strong in our feet to give us a little bit of strength and stability breathing deeply maintaining broad collarbones Some tension in the glutes is kind of reaching your tailbone down for the floor and abs kind of pulling up on the front of the pelvis maintaining a nice connection between the ribs and the hips in the front so the whole body is really connected we're pushing the floor away with our feet and staying tall continuing to just really breathe deeply in here and often we're going to go for about five to eight repetitions okay we're just trying to build up a little bit of fatigue in that shoulder and give it an initial kind of strengthening stimulus often we'll see even some pain reduction in this if we don't overdo it which is great um, usually encourage people to stay at a 0 to 10 for pain with that, but sometimes we'll get into a 1 or 2 out of 10 if you do have specific recommendations from your healthcare practitioner to kind of take that up a notch um, and if we feel that's going to be safe and reliable. Okay, so um, that is our isometric shoulder extension movement and it's great for helping you out in those initial post-surgical and post-injury stages uh, with your shoulder. All right, hope it helps.